What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode. Um, it's kind of, well, I haven't made a video in a while because it's rained for literally 16 days straight. Um, but today, as you can see, it, it's kind of gloomy. It's it's super windy, but it's, it's supposed to rain all day. It's, it was supposed to start at 10, but um, it hasn't, it has not rained since and it's 1.30 right now. So what I'm going to do today is right now I'm putting batteries in this camera. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go hang a couple cameras. Um, some of, some of these hunting spots that I got. Um, I'll kind of explain them, but I'll explain that kind of later. Later when it gets closer to the season. One, two. Uh, been doing a lot of salmon. Not a lot, but been doing salmon fishing. Um, I'm just not recording every one because it just it gets stupid after a while. It's like the same old boring thing. But okay, we got batteries in here. Make sure it works. On doing no car. Okay, I gotta get an SD card. That up there. Phone, SD card, Um, this is like I'm pretty sure the picture every 30 seconds every 15 this is video and test and test whatever okay one more thing I gotta grab here awesome mess okay Got the camera. Just gotta set this down for one minute. Okay, we're all set to go. Sorry, my uh, storage was filled up or whatever. So, I'm at the first spot. Um, I got the stand right up there. Um, this is this is one spot. There's a lake over there. The deer kind of filter from this way. They cross the lake, drink their water. They kind of run, run the edge up there. Come from this way or this way. Um, I don't really like it because if they come from anywhere over here, um, I'm kind of plain as day up in that tree, but it's like a it's a good 15 yard shot from right here But I don't know. We'll see. I I've never shot a deer out of this stand I missed one but up top. Um, I have I have a gun stand and every year I've shot I've shot a decent deer last year last year. It, it sucked here I don't know why but we used to get a lot of a lot of footage a lot of, a lot of pictures of um, nice mature deer, but it just Last year it totally just crashed on us and it really sucked, but I'm gonna hang a camera up um, right on that tree and we're just gonna let it sit for a couple months and we'll see how that one goes.
Okay, first spot done. Uh, I'm gonna, well, it's hot in here. Um, so, they cross this road right here. Right up there, there's a causeway, and then there's kind of a trail that goes in there. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just show you show you the car or the water so it's kind of a causeway right here shit it's so um all right that's that's just all it's all swamp and water i don't know what this dude here is doing what the hell but yeah that's then out there more is a lake so it's it's kind of nice um it's if right it's been raining so much that they don't even need water but when it's dry when it's hot and dry out, um, the deer, they love that water. They, they swim side to side. And it's, just, it's a good thing, but sometimes um, it definitely sucks, but it's cool. It's cool when they walk through it and cross because you can hear them swim. But, okay, we're going to make it to our next spot, and I'll see you there. Well, it's starting to, starting to kind of come down again here. So I'm, so I'm guess I'm gonna have to wait, wait a minute. It's kind of sucks. It's I don't think it's gonna stop. Um, it's I really I can't just like drive down there and do it because. It's uh, okay. I'll just try to explain from here. So, uh, we we're in kind of like back here. It's it's all a hill, and then it, it just slowly kind of slopes down, and then like right down in there, like all along this edge, it's a ditch. Not not a ditch, but it's just it's it's a lot less uh, higher than all the others. And right behind this beautiful cedar tree. Um, like in the woods line more I have a stand which I kind of screwed that up last year cuz I put it right like behind I'm like right in front of a trail that they run so they kind of bust me every time so I'm gonna just take that stand completely out and then I'm pretty sure like right right in there I'm gonna set up a, a ground blind so and then I'll, I'll be able to shoot down so it'll be it'll be better it'll be a little more um a little more hidden because i'm 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 more playing as days the last spot was here it's, it's kind of hard because they're all like straight birch beach wood and all those kind of stupid trees I don't, I don't know my trees but so i am gonna run down set that camera up really quick and Come back in here and go to the next spot. Uh, just got a fresh set of batteries in this camera. That, that made a weird sound. Um, I'm going to go run down there really quick, set it up, and I'll meet you back in here. Um, I'm not going to get the camera wet because it's too much money to ruin by a stupid ass rain. Because it rains all the time and I can never do anything. But I'll be right back with you. Okay, dope song. Um, so after I was leaving the second, the second uh, little spot that I set the camera up <clears throat> at, when I was driving to go to the the last one I did today, it really started a downpour. So I just said scratch camera. I just ran out there and did it real quick. But that spot is kind of where I am. But I'm driving out of it right now. It's 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 a long way in, but it's you go, you just kind of get off the road and then you go straight, straight alongside of a, a cornfield, and I'm in the very back corner of it. So 
Um, once that corn gets a little taller, the deer just kind of walk. They'll walk from this way, from my left side, if I'm looking straight at the corner, they'll walk from my left, and then they'll walk to the right, and then there's just a woods all over here. So once that corn gets long, they like to use that as cover, and it, I guess I just feel safe there. Um, so yeah, thank you guys. Wait, I'm not, I'm not going to end it yet. Uh, I, I hope you enjoyed. Um, it's, I, it's nothing really much, but just when I'm, when I'm making hunting videos this season, um, you'll kind of know, you kind of know what spots I'm going to be at. I'll update you with the pictures that I get from them. Um, I'm going to let the camera sit for probably maybe about a month, maybe a little more. We'll see. And next time we talk bow hunting or hunting will probably be in about a month a month and a half when i check those unless um i got a couple more spots that i could put cameras up i might do that too but uh change change some stands set that ground blind up um whatever we'll see i'll just keep you guys updated but thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed please leave a like and subscribe to tension team outdoors and we'll see you next time.